Won't you make up your mind? Cause I'm getting tired Of overthinking every move you make And I can't help you decide Who you're loving now And how I'm not quite there somehow Welcome back guys, so today I'm, today I'm here with Beauty Forever hair once more. It's the same packaging as usual. Um, okay, so I open the box and I see where I have two wig caps here. Looks kind of different, so we're going to get into that in a few. I've got a goodie bag here, so let's see what's in there before we move any further. Um, I've got a elastic band patterned one I uh, also got a bonnet I got a pair of lashes and a brush a makeup brush and finally in the box we have the wig this is a nice reddish light brown it's an auburn 13 by 4 lace front water wave wig this is 24 inches long this looks good. I like how loose the curls are. As I said, this is water wave. It looks so good. And from the other day, I've been loving these colors. I don't know if you guys remember the other the other day I wore uh, like kinky textured wig like this. But in this color, I should say, yeah, this is really nice. It's full to the tip. And for the inside of the wig, it has a total of three combs and adjustable straps in the back. Uh, it's a medium brown lace and it's also pre-plucked. The wig that is i can't wait to go ahead and install this i'm actually going to do a glue install today by the way so i'm excited for that and yeah that's how we're looking so let's go ahead and jump into this installation this is one of the wig caps that i got it's actually thinner than the typical um ball um wig cap i'm actually going to do a ball cap method today so I'm pretty excited about that. Yep. So I went ahead and I used my glue to, you know, apply around my hairline. And then now that I've done that, which I obviously fast forwarded. So I feel like this being thinner will help with the meltdown even more. And, you know, the install can look more realistic. It's really, really thin, guys. I love how thin they made this. So that's how we're looking. I'm just gonna go ahead and use some of my face powder. You know, to kind of camouflage this better. I prefer using powder than using like, you know, liquids just so that the area don't it don't make the area lift or just to not get it wet and oh be mindful guys i already kind of i cleansed the area with alcohol so there's no like residue so it will stick really well and as you know ball cap method help to just make your install more durable so you see how nice that looks So now I put on my wig and as I said, I'm just doing a nice glue install today. I'm going to cut away some of this extra lace and it's nicely pre-plugged. This is how we're looking. And of course, you know the drill. I'm just gonna line it up before I even proceed. Line it up with my natural hairline before I even proceed to like applying the glue. So with the excess, excess lace, not one half at a time. So, so when applying the glue, it, I go on the, I'm going to go on the very edge of the ball cap so that it's still sealed, like again. Won't you make up your mind? It's been such a long time since I've done the ball cap method, guys. I know. 
it, it all depends on you and what you prefer so if you prefer doing ball cap method then you can go ahead and do it it really depends on my mood and as I say I rarely do it but it really ensures a really nice durable install so I'm actually going to do three layers of this glue and then once I'm done drying down everything then I'll come back I'm getting tired of overthinking every move you make and I can help you decide now I've applied three layers of the glue place the wig the hairline down and do the same thing I'd always do just press it in so any parts that might seem like it would it would like this will completely dry in like 24 hours Who you love now and how I'm not quite there somehow my intuition says to give you up But my heart can't easily let you go mm -hmm. I try to tell myself this isn't love oh, 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 oh. I that I never really know If I should stay or be I decided to do soaps, so, of course And, you know, pull back the mid portion so what I'm gonna do is this is how the hair is looking it's so pretty so so pretty so I'm going to actually be doing a center part because the other day I'm so tempted to do pull back but I've been doing that from the other day so I'm just gonna do a center part vibe and you know get my wax stick and make that really nice and flat so far I can tell you the hair feels really nice and full um, I'm getting some shedding a little bit more than I would like so I would definitely love for them to improve on that but this is for me personally I prefer you guys know I prefer my curlier textures especially if you're going on vacation and stuff and be mindful even though it's easier to deal with on vacation like you know not you don't have to straighten it nor curl it like um you still have to ensure that you detangle these textures because if you don't they're going to get matted and dry and it will not look good at all so at least get up wet it up uh, or you know find your products that work best for you and detangle it on a daily basis you know once you're wearing it out so that's looking really nice and flat i'm just gonna go ahead and get my you know concealer and i'm gonna make the party more precise <laughs> So this is how the hair look in its dry state and as I said I run my hands through it I'm getting shedding so I am getting some shedding there as you guys can see and this is a really nice HD lace it looks really good see it's really nice without even wetting it up like you don't have to go in and wet it up if you don't wish you could rock it with all this volume it's really pretty so now that you guys have seen it like that let me go ahead and just spray it down with some water. I'm just waiting for the fire, but you won't even try to survive you. This is the hair weight it looks so good no i can tell you this this color is so perfect for summer but i feel like it's also so nice for fall and we're going into fall soon like we're at the end of summer and i feel like this is just gorgeous like the reddish like you know brownish vibe it's just a beautiful auburn wig like it's really really nice let me know what you guys think about it. As I said, this is not the first time I'm now rocking this color. It's not the first time I'm rocking this color. And I'm really, it's, it has grown on me. Loving it. So let me know what you guys think. 
in my comment section as usual i'm going to be sure to put the um details on this wig in my description box as well as the direct link so if you guys are interested you can go ahead and get this for yourself any available discount codes will also be listed shout out to beauty forever once more for this gorgeous wig and that's it for today's wig look thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video and i can help you decide who you love now and how i'm not quite there somehow my intuition says